Hey everybody, it's 3 Collector 91 here, and today we have another Epic Mail Day. I believe this is our 37th Epic Mail Day. Um, it's a great series, I love doing this, just showcasing what I get in the mail. So I've been posting every Monday, now for the past oof, three months. I want to keep that going, I believe I have enough mail just to keep it going. Um, I enjoy doing this for you guys. Uh, it doesn't get a lot of views, but it's not what I'm worried about. I'm just worried about having fun and just showcasing some cards I get in the mail here. First one was an auction win of UC Soros on SFTV 24-7 auctions uh, on Facebook. Uh, I paid 950. Uh, I'm not sure if it was shipped. I think it was 950 shipped. Uh, UC Soros is the starting goalie for Nashville. He's had his struggles, but um, still a good goalie. So uh, Fleer Ultra at a 699. Exclusives out of 100 prospects. I believe this is red hot out of, you can see there, 50. Nice low numbered one. Uh, duo here with uh, Bietto, or Bietto, and Saros there out of 399. Stonewall, just a base, base. Uh, prospects out of 499. And the um, OPG Platinum, sorry there, uh, rookie. So the value there, I'm hoping to get uh, over 20 just for this card, and then the exclusives and the other rookies. You know, maybe between two and five a piece just to make some money on that. Uh, next one up here is a trade off of Instagram from Hockey Cards Plus. Uh, I believe there's two packages from him in this mail day. Um, the first one here, we made a trade and then he kept posting more Kappa cards. So then I uh, messaged him again. We did a second trade. First one here is Mark Roberio. I got this in my Com C mail day. I kind of forgot I had it incoming. I bought a uh, Com C mail day so long ago, I believe like November of last year. Uh, nice, um, I'm not even sure what they're called, it's just a black um, prism auto. Next one here is Carter Verhage. Um I was looking to buy this on Instagram a while back. He was on Tampa and the guy was asking for over $25. I believe I got it for like a five trade value. So definitely a good evaluation there. I love Carter Verhage and his cards. Tukarski here, uh, just the autograph icebreakers from Pinnacle that I didn't have. And then a Barbario here, rookie ticket auto. Um, I didn't have this card. I have the one out of 100, which is the retail exclusive, but uh, I do need the, the regular one here uh, for the set that I collect. Um, in the second trade here, you'll see I got a little bonus, but uh, this is just his plug here, his first variation of his um, business card, so you'll see the second version um, later. Uh, I got $5 trade value out of this. Um, out of 199 Crown Royal. Um, beautiful card. Uh, I believe I have a Headman and uh, St. Louis of the same version, so I might put them together. Uh, interesting card. I'm uh, very funky. Uh, it's numbered out of yes, 199 Next one here, Dana Tyrell, uh, Metallic Bronze, just base auto, and JT Brown, Angel Inc. Uh, somebody has the 101 on, of this card. And looking for about a hundred dollars for it, so I'm not willing to pay that. But you know, for two dollars for the base auto, uh, definitely willing to pay. Second part of the trade here. I'll pull the cards out first. And then a surprise second. Uh, so we got another AHL auto of Tampa. Oh, the lighting just dim there from the sun. So here is his other business card, Hockey Cards Plus. He updated it. I have business cards look similar to this. I uh, just include them in trades and whatnot. Just to plug, you know, my uh, handle there. But here we have a Jonathan Marcia, so uh, AHL Auto. Play for the Lightning. Uh, parts of one season. Uh, ended up not signing, similar to Carter Verhage. Signed in Florida, also similar to Carter Verhage. And then exploded for 30 goals. So it seems like uh, Tampa lets these kind of fringe guys fall through and they explode somewhere else, which, you know, it's unfortunate, but it's the... Uh, Business of the cap, Cedric Paquette. Uh, I do have one of these already, but uh, I don't have many cards of per Paquette, so put that in the PC. A Blair Jones Young Gun didn't have, and a Carter Verhage Program of Excellence I also did not have. Um, interesting card, Canada Canvas card here. Not really a great photo, but uh, nonetheless, POE rookie card. Then next up here, we just have four Young Guns. I believe I got them for like two trade value each, and they're worth about $8 CAD at the time of recording. Uh, it's been doing really well. So I should have, I think, like $10, or uh, sorry, 10 um, Carter Behavior Young Guns now. So that's definitely awesome. And then in here, we have a Hockey Cards Plus Pen. 
So a nice little pen there, and I included it for the first three trades he did um, after he made the pens. So I think it's like a one of three for the pen there. This next one here, um, it is, I don't really want to show it because it's got my address on it. But it's a mail day from Upper Deck. It's Redemption I redeemed eight months ago now in a trade I made. It's this uh, Matthew Joseph rookie here at a $7.99. So it's a nice um, redemption, but it took, took forever to get here. Not too happy about that, but I'm glad I finally got it. This one here is an auction um, off Facebook again, but they vacuum sealed the carton. So it took me forever to get it actually out. But when I finally did, it is this Zach Whitecloud out of five from SP Game Used. Um, beautiful card. He's actually playing with the Knights now for most of the start of the season and I think the last playoffs. A great player. Uh, well, not a great player, but he's an up and coming defenseman. Don't think he's a real high pick. $40 value on it. I'd say that's probably what it's worth. I think I paid seven shipped. So definitely a good deal there. You know, trade, sell, or whatever. Um, this next pack here, I forgot I even got it. It was this lot of cards, very random assortment. But I included some of the cards in the background. Um, Sean Avery and Paul Bissonette. They're two of my favorite players, um, post-career. I just think they're, they're both hilarious in their own ways. Um, so yeah, I show up a lot here. So the first one is uh, Isaac Lindestrom. Uh, young Gun and a Henry Yoki Haru Young Gun. Not really cards I'm looking for, but they're in the lot, so it's whatever. Uh, as you can see here, this first card, Paul Bissonette, I do already have. I think I paid 50 cents just for the Paul Bissonette in the background there a while back. Um, kind of when he was starting out with Spitting Chicklets. Uh, this card, I believe, is probably worth $15 to $20 just based on his post career and the fact that Paul doesn't have a lot of cards, so. Definitely a score there for me. Hit 11 shipped for the lot. Um, next up here is a Nick Girdles, Young Gun. Didn't really pan out anywhere, I don't believe. Uh, next one here is a, I don't even know this was in the lot. Patrice Bergeron, rookie from In the Game, I believe. Uh, let's see. In the Game, yeah. So In the Game, rookies don't go for a lot, but still, it's mint condition, so maybe $5. Uh, next one up here, uh, Sean Avery jersey. Do not have one of these. Uh, doesn't have a lot of autos or jerseys either. He's a very polarizing player uh, for the for the Rangers there. I do have his jersey hanging in my room just as an homage to his uh, antics. I think he's hilarious. So those, the Bissonette I might sell, but the Avery I'm definitely keeping. Next one here is this popping out of the card, if you can see that. Matt Cassian. Uh, my name is Matt. I might keep this card just based on that, but uh, I might sell it. I haven't decided yet. Be a very beautiful patch there. So, and the last one here is Chris Pronger. He's also funny. I'm just a big meathead. One of the greatest defensemen um, in the modern era, from you know 2000 to 2010. But uh, yeah, so that was that lot. Oh, I still got three or four more packages left here. This one's from Beauty Cards on Instagram. Uh, let's see if his exact handle is beauty underscore cards underscore est 2019 10 shipped for this dylan gambrell uh clear-cut young gun i believe i can get north of 20 dollars for it so he's asking you know eight plus two shipping i was willing to pay that just because uh seemingly like an easy flip um he's an okay player gambrell brings you know fourth liner for the the sharks there next up here we have this giant package it came for, within three days of me winning the auction giant package here there's a lot of four graded cards um it's the bccg uh, beckett just like confirming it's a real card kind of thing justin braun i paid six dollars shipped um justin braun here first card uh, as you can see like the top corner there it's not even mint why is it saying 10 i don't know your bet your guess is just as good as mine uh anders lindback played for the lightning for parts of i think two or three seasons didn't really pan out might keep it, might not. It's not worth a whole lot um, with the, you know, the Beast of CG. So I haven't decided on that one. Um, he would slide into my former, like, Lightning PC. A lot of cards here. Not sure if I'm keeping or not. Uh, next one up here is Dmitry Kulikov. I believe he's on the Devils right now. He was on Winnipeg. Um, it's just kind of a whatever card. 
main part of the deal was for this Patrick Maroon Young Gun. I think I believe I paid like $8 for my raw one uh, in an earlier mail day video. So to pay $6 ship for you know, the four cards here I was willing to pay. Uh, he's a funny player. Uh, shot the puck at the Dallas Stars bench in the, in the finals just because Tampa was losing. <laughs> he just wanted us through the pot. Uh, just a funny guy on and off the ice on um, the celebrations. And this last auction win here is for this Jake for Tannen. SPX um, rookie jersey auto. Uh, it's a sticker auto, I believe, but it's from 1516 SPX at a 4.99 here. So this is the year that um, McDavid was a rookie, so this stuff has shot up in price. Uh, the card though, less than ten dollars. I think I paid 17 shipped for the two. And this other one here, let's take the tape off. It's a rookie booklet. Ultimate Rookie Auto Booklet of Jake Vertanen out of 99. Let's open it for you here. Out of the way. So there it is in all its glory. Just a two, um, two swatch autograph on card uh, booklet of Jake Vertanen. Sells for north of 30 on eBay. So if I can get, you know, 30 and, you know, even five for that, that's 35. Double my money, buy some Tampa cards or Biz Nasty or Avery cards. Something like that. So yeah, guys, that's it for the mail day. Uh, let me know what card's your favorite. Um, honestly, I think mine is the Sean Avery. I think he's just... I've said it a million times, I'll say it a million more. He's hilarious. So I'd like to thank uh, Hockey Cards Plus and Beauty Cards for the, for the deals. So yeah, guys, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.